Hi everybody, welcome back. I'm Judy Yarborough, the City Marketer for the City of Reedsville, and I'm here today with Angela Stadler, our City Clerk, and we're going to talk about our sesquicentennial. Good job. I know, it's hard. <laughs> it is hard. I think we're going to do a commercial about that, so we're going to get people to say it. So, but we want to talk to you today about our Wall of Mayors. So, um, Angela, you want to give us some info about that? Yes, well actually this wall of mayors was done in 1987 by the city officials at the time and they did a really good job of piecing together the history of the city of Reedsville in regards to the mayors. Uh, they did not have all of the photos because you know back then the internet wasn't like it is today. There wasn't as much genealogy as there is today. So we've been able to find a lot of the things that they haven't, you know, weren't able to find back then. So that was 35 years ago that they yes. put this up, um, but you're still missing some, aren't you? Yes, we are definitely missing some. We found that we had some photos that uh, are mayors that we didn't even know about. So like there's one, uh, Dr. Thomas Hughes, which we believe was the second mayor of Reedsville. Mortimer Oaks was the first mayor, but his picture is not up on the wall. So he was like 1873 when the city was incorporated. So we are looking right now for some pictures of the mayors as well as finding out which mayors we're missing. So Mortimer Oaks, that was the one that you were looking for for a long time. Did you finally find a picture of him? Yes, thanks to local historian uh, Bob Carter. Mm -hmm. Everyone knows Bob Carter if you know the history of Reedsville in Rockingham County. Right, Bob knows it. <laughs> <laughs> Bob knows it. So he actually put us up with this book which is a history of the First Baptist Church here in Reedsville. And it has a lot of pictures of several uh, city leaders in here, not only the mayors, but also some city managers and council members. So it's been very helpful. So that's great. And so our current mayor, Donald Gorham, um, is our first um, African-American black mayor that we've had. Yes. Um, we did have, uh, our council though is very diverse, um, which is wonderful. Um, and we did have one female mayor, yes. um, Laura. Laura Feltz. Right, and she recently passed, sadly. She recently passed away. She was actually my kindergarten teacher and my swimming instructor when I was five years old. <laughs> Wonderful lady, I mean, true epitome of class. And uh, she loved Reedsville, all things Reedsville, and was so dedicated to the city. We truly miss her. We sure, we really hoped that she would be here for the sesquicentennial right. in 2023. But so, we will miss her. And we, Chris and I just talked about some of the, all the events that we've got going on, which is going to be amazing. But you really are looking for pictures. That's what you're looking for, are you not? That's true. We are going to start a social media campaign. You may have already spoken about it, but on the City of Reedsville Facebook page, we're hoping to put uh, some blurbs out there asking for both information about former mayors, city managers, uh, you know, directors of departments. We're looking for just about everything. We're also looking for photos just regarding the City of Reedsville's history. Now, we can't promise if you send us a photo that we'll use it but we would certainly be appreciative of anything the citizens of Reedsville or people who have left Reedsville but have ties to the city could send us. And that would be great. And so one of the things that we are doing, I and mean, as I mentioned with the magazine, we've got um, information about history in there. We're looking for pictures to put in that. We're also looking for artifacts that you might have um, that we could put on display at the Governor Reed House. Um, so any kind of information that you have would be greatly appreciated. And if you've got that kind of information, you can reach out to Angela. And how can they get you, Angela? Well, they can obviously reach me here at Reesville City Hall. They can call me at 336-349-1040. That's my main number. They can also email me, which is at A. Stadler, so A-S-T-A-D-L-E-R, at symbol reedsvillenc.gov. Right. So um, if you've got anything that you think, and even if you don't think it's that interesting to you, it may be very interesting to us. So if you've got anything like that, any kind of history, old pictures of um, the city, of, of your family, anything like that, and especially if you've got anything related to the mayors, um, Angela is very interested. We'll end with that cute little story Chris told me earlier about how you went online just yesterday. Actually, today. Um, it was morning. today, this morning. Yes. Okay, so tell them about that right quick. <laughs> well, Chris Phillips, who you've already, of course, spoken with, is 
pretty much a genealogy buff. So he has been able to look at a lot of our records and find information about former mayors and city managers. Anyway, he had come up with some information about our second city manager, which is E.B. Ware. And he was only a uh, town manager, or city manager, or whatever you'd like to call him, um, from 1924, I think, to 1926. Anyway, he was able to find some names of uh, children, grandchildren. We looked that up, we called a lady, and luckily it was his granddaughter, and she is going to be looking for a picture of E.B. Ware for us and any information that she can provide. I've already emailed her the request and said, please send us what you've got, and we're really excited about that. So thank goodness for the internet. Uh, thank Google goodness. is amazing. <laughs> it's amazing that they were able to get as much done back in 1987 without the resources I know, we have today. <laughs> it is. I, I sometimes wonder how I can survive without it. Yeah. So. So we want to thank you guys for joining us today. Again, um, remember, if you've got anything that you think might be of interest, call Angela, email it to her. We do not have to have full copies. You can take a picture, digitally send it to us. That'll be fine, too. Um, so anything you've got, just let us know. And thanks for joining us today.